I'm sorry. How hard is it for TV, uh, for uh, pay TV channels to compete with um, digital trends? Um, I don't think it's much competition at all. Uh, I think as long as you adapt your your business model, which we've done, um, you know, we we we've we've ramped up our production uh, in in our Central European business from zero to 300 hours in two years, and we're going to double that further. So I think you know the more that we we really want to concentrate on our customer and our viewer and programming for them. So then you know we can work with digital players, we can work with ourselves, we can build an audience, we can stay relevant. So I see it as a as a way to as a way to build opportunity rather than a threat, really. Somebody said at the panel that um, the audience is I, I love this platform agnostic. Uh, people don't care, they don't care where the content. No, is. they don't care. I think. Listen, I think, what industry are we in? We're in the industry to entertain people. And I think we want to entertain a, a viewer, somebody sitting at home, somebody that's leaving work, somebody that's, you know, had a hard day or just wants to escape. This is where, and they don't care where they're going to watch it as long as they can find it. So I think we've got a challenge, which is to, to entertain them and produce something that they want to watch. And then we want also need to help them find it. And that's been the game for the last, what, 70, 80 years. It hasn't really changed too much. Um, and I don't, you know, when you start talking about rights or platforms or who, where they, they don't care. They're saying, I like this show, yeah. you know, like we, you know, like a good doctor or SWAT or our, 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 a lot of our productions like Real Housewives of Budapest or um, Ultraviolet, mm -hmm. they find it. Mm -hmm. They want to watch it. They don't care where it is. So what would, be, what would be your message to all those people saying that, you know, Fay TV is a, is a dinosaur. It's not going to be around in five years. <laughs> I would say that it depends what. You know, maybe in some cases that's probably true, but I think in, in other cases, if you're adapting your model and you, you, you know what you are, you know that you're in the entertainment business and you can adapt, you, you, you're going to be fine. There's a lot of work to do. It's not easy. Very easy thing to say, but I think, I think there's, there's also tremendous opportunities. More great programming is being made today. People are watching more than they did on different devices. And I think if you get that part right, you're going to have a wonderful business. And you know, we've actually seen our business is, 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 is flourishing as a result of that. So I, I see this as a huge, really an opportunity, as I said. So um, we, we have to have this conversation again in five years to see if... Uh... Oh, yeah, well, if, we, if we're not, yeah. We're, <laughs> to we're follow up. Yeah, well, I have to take that bet, yeah. Thank you so much. Okay, fine. Thank you.